I was eating in the restaurant one day with a friend, and it was a fast food restaurant, and the individual took the wrapper from the straw and just started twirling it and kept twirling it. And even as we left the restaurant, kept this piece of paper um, with them as we continued on with our day and just kept twirling it. And I saw it and kind of looked at it and kind of thought, boy, he sure is keeping that piece of paper and twirling it and put it in the back of my mind. We really didn't think about it. Um, but then I saw um, an artist who took just a larger form of this newspapers rolled up and made beautiful art out of it. They um, created um, figures which were life size and were mounted on a platform and were placed in a mall area or some other type of area where people passed. And I said, let me see if I can try and do this with on a much smaller scale um, with tissue paper. So, um, in the following clips you'll see my I think it was a fail, it wasn't a success, but um, you know, it does lead to other um, ideas. So, this all came from seeing someone twirl a wrapper from a straw and then um, finding some beautiful art on the internet. Okay, another project. Um, I'm experimenting with something um, that I saw someone fiddling with, but I will explain it um, in another clip before this clip. But this is basically um, tissue paper, and I don't know, maybe it's 16 by 24, something like that. It's kind of large. I took two pieces and I cut, let's say, at a half an inch intervals all the way up and I had little strips and I took each strip and twirled it in my fingers and so I have this from two pieces of paper so I'm going to show you what I'm going to try to create with this stay tuned Okay, um, this is how far I've gotten trying to salvage this project. Um, I started using this paste to try and keep the body together. Um, it's not a clear paste or white paste. It was some old paste that I had lying around and it has, you know, specks and flecks of colored paper in it. So the body has become speckled. Um, really just trying to get it to stay together. I released the rubber band here and around the breast trying to widen the waist a little bit and then trying to let it dry just a little bit um, and then I'm going to try and put it in some type of a pose. I thought this was going to be a fast way to make a body um, it's not taking a long time, but I do have other things to do, so I'm going to, I don't know, see how it turns out.
Okay, this is what I came up with based on twirled tissue paper. This is my little tissue paper person. Um, I formed the pose with her just lying flat. Um, I wasn't thinking like maybe she could, he or she could be sitting on a chair. I guess if I had a chair of the correct height. But um, I formed the person this way. Um, pros and cons. Um, I don't think it's a faster way of making a person, which is kind of what I was maybe looking for. Just a body to form into a shape and to take a picture, to create a scene. That's what I wanted the body for. Um, you need a lot more strips of tissue paper than I have for this particular person. The body suggests the breasts and the buns in the back the arms and legs inside were um, um, fattened up with just wads of tissue paper and not total strips of tissue paper so just to make that clear because um, I didn't have enough and this was kind of like a fast project and um, I secured joints with white small rubber bands that I had until I completed, completed making the body and a con or something which maybe I should not have done but I needed the body to stick together in some way was to use a paste that I used just in um, paper making and I don't think it's the paste I think any type of moisture is going to affect and weaken the integrity of the tissue paper which is very fine so once I did put the paste on, the tissue paper kind of started to fall apart a little bit. You can see the legs and um, uh, you know, the legs over here. Um, but it was a very fast project and um, a pro to the paste is that when it did dry, it dried, you know, keeping the area together. I think I just still had to just take my time and work on it. Um, but, uh, you know, I could kind of see doing this again. Um, I do wonder how it would be to make a tree out of something like this with, um, um, without wire. Um, really taking one's time and, you know, figuring out the branches and, um, just making that. So, this is strips of tissue paper. Um, body, a little tissue paper person, I guess. Um, it's amazing how you just see things. Um, as I said, this just started with someone twist, twirling a piece of um, wrapper from a straw. So there you go. Um, I will put the name of the artist that I saw on the internet, her art, because um, um, it's it's really beautiful. Okay. Everyone have a very blessed day. This is Monday, September the 28th, I do believe. Alright, bye.